This is the ScanLogic Basic from Securium Systems. It has a RF fingerprint reader on the top here. Now this lock is a little bit different than our normal code hierarchy when you're installing it on a safe. It comes default with two codes, 123456, which is the manager code, that's how you open the safe. It also comes with a reset code, and the reset code is used to reset the entire lock back to factory default. You might do this in case someone loses their codes or the person who has the fingerprint enrolled isn't available, but it'll allow you to recover and set it all back to factory default. This code is similar to the super code that is found in all our other locks, where you maintain that super code against the safe serial number as a reset code. So here's what happens. The reset code is set to six nines. So we'd enter 999999, and then we would hold down the number six in order to set this whole back to... Fa so the reset code by default is six nines. So you'd enter 999999. Then you'd hold down the number six, and that would set it all back to factory default. No matter what fingerprints were installed, or no matter, no matter what fingerprints were enrolled, or codes were enrolled, it would set it all back to factory default. And the manager code would be at default of 123456. The reset code, however, stays as originally set. So we're going to show you now how to change the reset code. And this is a process that you're very familiar with because it's exactly the same as changing a code on this unit or on the Safe Logic series. Here's how you do that. First of all, you enter six zeros. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then you enter the existing reset code. Nine, 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 nine. Now you enter a new reset code. Let's say nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. And then you repeat it. 987654. That code has now been set. Now, in order to test it, the best way to test it is to enter the old reset code. And it says this is invalid. The red lights come on and it beeps that long beep, which says this is an error. Now, we could also test the reset code. We won't go ahead with the full reset process here, but you'll see it enters a, uh, as a valid code. So 987654, and it's a valid code. You see it doesn't open the safe, but it's waiting for me to press the six button to delete all the users. I'm just gonna let that time out. But that's how you can test it online as you're installing these safe locks to ensure that the reset code has been changed from its default. Check the default, make sure it gives you that error code, then check the new reset code to make it sure that it gives you a positive green light at the top here. Now let's show you the process to reset the ScanLogic Basic. Let's assume someone has forgotten their codes or the person whose fingerprints are enrolled is no longer available to open this lock. They could call into you as the safe manufacturer. You could then give them the reset code. When you enter the reset code and then press the number six and hold it, it will wipe this whole thing back to factory default. So now your, your code, your default manager code, will be set back to 123456. It doesn't change the reset code, it stays as is. So here we go. 987654, press and hold the six button. You get that beep and then beep beep to say that is completed. Now it's all set back to factory default. If I enter the default code for the manager, one, two, three, four, five, five, six, that lock opens. And there are no other codes installed here because it has set it all back to factory default. Your reset code remains as 987654. So 987654. You'll see it's green lights. It's waiting for me to press six. I won't press it, but you'll see that it's green lights, meaning that code is still the correct code. If you ever wanted to change the reset code, you could certainly do that by following the same process. Six zeros to enter change code mode, the existing reset code, new reset code, new reset code. So that's how the ScanLogic Basic works with a reset code. Again, remember that the reset code is not an opening code or an access code. It simply does the job of resetting it back to factory default. That's the ScanLogic Basic from SecureM Systems.